Well, hello there, friends. You know I love salmon? We're making a delicious salmon. This time we're gonna do it in a fry pan. We're gonna pan fry it in a fry pan, and then we're gonna steam it with some delicious butter and lemon and honey and all kind of goodies. Remember, friends, thumbs up if you like the video. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and ring that bell. And stay tuned, we're making salmon together. Well, hello there, friends. You know I love salmon. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna make a very, very easy one. For those of you that don't wanna turn on the oven, that's perfect. We're cooking in a fry pan. I'm gonna show you. I got two beautiful filet of salmon right there. What we're gonna do, we're gonna put a little salt and pepper on them. And yeah, you know, I like a little coarse black pepper. And uh, I, I think it comes out really nice. And a little bit of fleur de sel. Um, I got clarified butter in here, friends. Clarified butter. Um, for those of you that have been following the channel, you know why I'm having clarified butter because it doesn't burn as fast, right? But we're going to use regular butter because I'm going to make a little uh, a couscous pasta that I'm going to serve with it. Pa uh, uh, um, pound the, uh, the, uh, uh, the fish, the, the fish, the pepper in it, right? And then we're going to put it right in there, friends. We're going to give it a beautiful color. Now, the side you're going to serve your fish in, the side you're going to serve your fish on the plate, is the side you should put it first. So this is the end of, end of fish right there that I got right there. Because what I'm going to do, I'm going to turn it. I'm going to turn the fish in a, in a minute. After I got a really nice color out of it, I'm going to turn it. And, uh, and, and, uh, but the, the side that I'm going to serve the fish is the one in the bottom. So we leave it alone. We leave it alone. We're going to put a little salt and pepper in there. We're not going to disturb it. Okay, and at that you can do this with so many other fish, right? A Chilean sea bass would be great in there. A, a grouper, a snapper would be great in there. Uh, same, same principle, same principle, really simple, right? A little salt and pepper, don't touch it. So then we get a nice caramelization, eh? And then what I'm gonna do, friends, I am going to serve this with, uh, see if I use regular butter by now, it'll be burned. Uh, yeah, regular butter would actually be burned by now. You see, so I want a nice, really beautiful color. And then, right here, my friends, I'm going to serve it with a little uh, uh, couscous. This is Israeli couscous. It's like a pasta. It's just a round pasta. Hey, you, come back over here. See, <laughs> that was hot. <laughs> you come back over here, you. What are you doing in there? So, um, I'm going to uh, uh, put a little butter, regular butter. And uh, <laughs> we like butter. Uh, for those of you that are new to the channel, friends, Welcome. We have so many new subscribers. We love you guys. You're fantastic. Uh, and, and it's a channel. We use butter. <laughs> Lots of butter. And, and we're very healthy. But, butter is good. We love it. Hey, let's check it to see how we're doing here, my friends. I don't want to overcook the fish, okay? I, just, I want to be beautiful golden brown, but I don't want to overcook it. So another a, a 38 seconds. Uh, I got a little shallots in there, friends. Just a little shallots. Very simple. This is a very simple recipe, eh? I'm gonna make it with a couscous. So the, the couscous I already called it, I already cooked. You can do make it with also pasta. I make it with any pasta you like, my friend. It doesn't matter. Right? And then we're gonna flip it. Okay, well, look at that. See, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Reduce the heat, reduce the heat. Jump here, reduce the heat. Okay, look. I'm gonna put with it. I got those baby carrots that I bought. I hope I'm not confusing Jack too much because I'm going left and right. You okay over there, Jack? He's good. <laughs> so look. Um, uh, I got the, 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 the shallots in here. You could use onion if you don't have shallots. It's the same, right? And then we're going to put this orzo pasta. The orzo, not orzo. Uh, couscous. Okay, orzo would be perfectly fine. Couscous is just, it's called Israeli couscous. It's just a round pasta. That's all it is. No big deal. It sounds good, though. And it, you know what? I love it. I love it because the, um, the texture of it is, is awesome. It really is. The texture of it is awesome. At the end, we're going to put a little bit of parsley, okay? And we're going to do the carrot. Now, look look at this. I bought those carrots uh, today at the grocery store, and they call it Le Petit Carotte, <laughs> of many colors. Le Petit Carotte, it's in French. I fell in love with it. I need to buy it. Look at this. Look how cute they are. So you know what I did? I, I'm not so sure about those. They're not so cute, but that's okay. 
Uh, and it came like that. It's pretty cool, right? So look, friends. I'm going to put a little lemon juice in there. And lemon, as we know, is acid. So to offset the lemon, the, the acidity, we're going to put a little sugar and we're going to use a beautiful honey. So the honey is not going to be sweet. Uh, maybe a little more. The honey is not going to be sweet and, uh, and the lemon is not going to be acid. And that's called gastric. Those two together. You see? Very simple, right? Eh? Right? A little bit of lemon right there. We're going to put a little bit of garlic because we love garlic. We love garlic. And we don't want to burn it, right? So what's going to happen? We're going to cover this, friends. All right? We're going to cover it. And we're going to let it cook. And this right there, very simple. You see? I told you it was going to be a simple dish. This is a one, two, three dish, friends. You're hungry? Make a little pasta, make a little orzo, make a little couscous, whatever you got. What we're going to do, friends, it's going to be ready soon now. We don't want to overcook the fish. I put a little soy sauce in there for my soul. Just a little bit. Just a little bit. Don't go in there and put it too much now. Just a little bit. Just a little bit. That's going to give us nice salt. All right? So now, friends, we're going to cook the fish to what temperature? That's the thing. Most people overcook the fish. As far as I'm concerned, a salmon should never be cooked over 125 degrees, 130 degrees at the maximum. Most fish, 120, 125, 130, you cook them more than that, it's going to be dry. It's up to you now. A lot of people don't like medium rare salmon. Uh, I can't have it overcooked. It's dry. You notice? You go to a restaurant, you order fish, or you order salmon, order, order medium. Right now the chef's nose. So let's see what we got here, friends. It's been in there a very short time, and it's not going to be ready. I just want to check it to see what I got. You see, I got 90. I got 87.90, right? 87.90. I'm in the middle. Make sure when you go, friends, you don't go all the way touching the, um, touching the, 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 the fry pan. I see people going all the way in. No, you just got to go to either, just a little bit. That's all. And you see right here, I'm 102. All right, so what do I do? I put this like this. I let it go slowly. Medium. This is ready. The cows are going to be hot. It's going to be ready. So when I'm 120, I come back and we'll play it. Uh, how simple was this, friends? Be back in a few minutes when it's 120, okay? I hope I put everything. Did I forget anything, Jack? What do you think? No, I think I got everything. We're good. Be back in a minute. Okay, friends. Took a few minutes. You know what I did? I basted it. I think Jack caught, caught me uh, doing it, but I just based a little bit, you see? I'm going to do it again. <laughs> but I, uh, yeah, I based it a little bit. And this is ready. Okay, we're plating. Very simple, right? I mean, you see that, my friends. That is not a complicated dish, right? I'm just going to put it here for, uh, for a second, just to plate. Otherwise, you know what's going to happen? Then I'm going to take it, and I'm gonna, we're going to put it right here. Right, very simple. So the cows are cool, right? But you know, you're not going to find those cows easily. It just happened at the grocery store. I had it, had them, so it is very cool. But if you can't find carrots like that, you can take um, a regular carrots, friends. Re regular carrots. You don't have to have a la petite carrot. And, um, <laughs> right? And uh, regular carrots, and you peel them. And look, look, look. A child could do this, my friend. This is so simple, eh? This is so simple of a dish, friends. No, no fancy, nothing fancy here. We don't do fancy things on this channel. We have fun, my friends. I just want to make sure we do it nice now. We don't want to be too slappy looking, right? That's all. We don't want to be slappy looking. And then we're going to take our, our beautiful sauce right there, friends. And we're going to put it right here. And we have a self, such a simple, such a beautiful, um, and all we need now is a beautiful leaf of parsley that I don't have, but I'll get it later. I'll make a nice thumbnail with it. And voila, my friends, we're going to put just a little bit more parsley on top. And we have ourselves a very simple dish that you guys can make in literally minutes. I, I, I Literally minutes. That's what I always try to do, friends. Now let's eat it. What do you think? Yeah. <laughs> That's the best part of the day. <laughs> I know it's the best part of the day for Jack, that's for sure. <laughs> here we go. <laughs> now, here we go. We're going to go in. Now, depends how you like it, friends. I just like it. You see right there? Look at this. 
Look at this, Vince. Look at this. You see? It's not overcooked. It's gorgeous. It's still in the center. Some of you are going to think, oh, you know, I like it almost cooked. Some of you are going to say, well, I like it undercooked. Cook it however you want, my friends. I think it's going to be perfect. Mmm. 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 And the salad. Look at the salad. Oh. My friends, it's delicious. It only took a few minutes. I hope you enjoyed it. Remember, thumbs up if you like the video. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and don't forget to ring that bell. Thanks for watching, friends. We'll see you soon.